is Chinese bread. It's a coconut bread. Actually, not this is in any Chinese restaurant. So our ingredients: all-purpose flour. We have our milk, powdered. We have our sugar. We do have our yeast in a baking powder and a pinch of salt we need. And of course, smells good. If you see the yeast looks like that, she has successfully grown. And that's our egg. We have two eggs that we mix. I'm gonna add one more. And of course, we have our butter. Uh, to leave it wash so wonderful. Hi guys, sorry I'm singing, I miss my dad. Okay. Here's our mixture. We're gonna gradually add our first. Your songs will live forever. Take a look, I added the milk and of course the egg. In my arms when times get rough. Mix your dough with Sing your dough with your lovely voice because it's in your kitchen. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. And we're gonna place our divine butter here. Wonderful. It's gonna be so soft. This is gonna be a gorgeous bread, I'm telling you. It's a coconut, Chinese coconut bread. Three cups of flour. It's pretty much a lot already. But this is dirty now. Look, mix it. Proofing, we're gonna let it sit for like two hours. Look at our dough, it has risen successfully. So this is our coconut bread. This will be our filling. So our filling will be a combination of sweetened condensed milk and a desiccated coconut. So I'm gonna mix so we're it. We're gonna need this for final breakdown of our bread or coconut bread so this is the second broth I just punch her in oh you can smell the gas in here it's, it smells good I love that smell when we're proofing guys is my favorite smell make a round ball of your bread you can also add more she's very soft you can add more flour in there Put it like that, clip it, clip it, in the middle punch it all, and we're going to round it, around the ball, so we're filling this with coconut, desiccated coconut, and so she's going to be a little wet inside. one teaspoon of desiccated coconut and you just place it inside you can put also sweetened cream if you want but I think for now we will just place desiccated coconut so she has a coconut in her already so take a look place our desiccated coconut inside a full teaspoon tuck it in it's a very soft dough guys it's gonna be so delicious because this is basically a combination of coconut and milk bread so take a look So you can just tuck it in, make it that soft, round balls like that. The weight are variable because I just eyeball it, but you can make a standard weight if you weigh your dough. So they're big though, they're huge and we're gonna let it sit for another hour. I'm gonna show you the progress here with fresh milk and a little water. Look, to give a color, you just have to lay some milk there with milk and water actually. 
but I did a good quality milk. It's not a buttermilk, it's just fresh milk. Look at the texture. She looks like Bauchi, guys, but it's going to be changing in color pretty soon. The all-purpose flower is very gorgeous if you have the good quality. Look on this no. recipe. So we have seven coconut bread. Coconut, bread. Chinese coconut bread. Very ginormous. Chinese coconut bread. It's kind of like a bow cheek color. You can make this golden brown or whatever works for you, but I like it infinite white, so it's beautiful. You see the gorgeous, it's still very hot, that's why I put it in a cookie rack. It's still so hot, guys. Take a look at the bottom. It's still very hot. And it won't fit with my cookie rack. We made seven of them. And I already tasted it. It's very delicious. Very fresh. The coconut gives a very distinct taste of the bread. Coconut is very healthy. And remember, there is also coconut inside filling. So that's really another thing when you open your bread. So this is our ginormous Chinese coconut bread. Look. Please click like and subscribe and share some comments below.